Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So you are now viewing me from my bathroom. That's why you see towels here. But I figured I'm about to go shower and I wanted you guys to see my skincare routine because I don't have a skincare routine on my channel at all. And recently I started using this brand called X, sorry, NXN Beauty, which a lot of beauty bloggers have been talking about. And so far it's been working pretty well on my skin so i wear makeup almost i want to say almost every day it varies like i feel like if i'm doing videos consistently i'm wearing makeup a lot but on a daily basis um usually i wear makeup maybe three times a week um three to four times maybe and then also when i do wear makeup i wear it for a long period of time super super hot anyways excuse me i'm like kind of whispering because like everybody's asleep right now anyways so first what i like to do is take my makeup off my cat is like outside my door so if you hear him meowing that's why um so first actually i like to just remove any jewelry that i have on um i only take off my first pair of earrings because everything else is recently or freshly pierced so I just keep those on um, and then I take my makeup off so to take my makeup off I like to use the makeup eraser towel it looks like this and I just wet it it's reusable I literally had it for three years now and I wash it once a week in the shower literally just use body soap doesn't matter and I just scrub it in the shower and you know strain it drain it out clean it um i will say i feel like a lot of my breakouts have been happening because of this because like if i don't wash this frequently i like the, you know along over time there's going to be makeup on the towel so when you when you want to remove your makeup it's like you're adding makeup back onto your face so you want to make sure that you wash this as frequently as possible twice a week is better but i do it once a week so so I'm going to be removing my makeup off right now and I just like to jam out to some music while I do this. This is my bare face. Um, so at this point, <clears throat> what I like to do. <clears throat> So I don't like to use NXN Beauty straight away on my face just because I still have some residue on my face of makeup after I even wipe it off. And this is, I'm not saying it's expensive, but I like to use like a different um, face cleanser first and then I use this. So what I've been liking is the First Aid Beauty Pure Skin Face Cleanser which is this um it's like almost done i had it for about three months now and this really gets rid of all the dirt and impurities that are in my skin um i usually use this twice and then go on with that nxm beauty but sometimes once um so it says removes surface oils makeup dirt safe for sensitive skin which i think i pretty much have sensitive skin so <clears throat> this camera has like a little like smoother on it but I do have some breakouts like over here and that's pretty much it. I don't have breakouts anywhere else on my chin. Um, yeah, so I'm just going to put my hair back and what I like to use also, I don't have like the Clarisonic because it's mad expensive. So I bought this at Ricky's when I used to work at Ricky's and this is um, just like a manual little scrubber for your face i do this very very gently not you know 
vigorously and this helps scrub um, anything on my face and it helps remove um, any dead skin I used to only wash my face with my fingers and I'm just like I don't know how I did that because I don't know once I started using this my face just feels different like it feels better so yeah so first what I'm going to do is I'm going to tie my hair back with this scarf that I have I don't have any like pins or anything to hold my hair back so I'm just gonna put that on right now So yeah, this is like basically what I do. Um, and I'm just gonna wet it and then I'm gonna put this on top and then I'm just gonna rub it in. So I don't know if you guys can tell, but you see some, <laughs> I look crazy, you see um, like the makeup on it, it's not as white, so that means it's getting off any extra makeup off my face. I just rinse it and then I also kind of like wipe my face off with this. I don't just like throw water on it, if that makes sense. Okay, so I just rinsed my face off and I like to pat my face dry. Okay, so this is my skin with nothing on it. And I, I'm trying to get rid of this right here. And some spots. It's like I have some like spots on my face, like not actual like pimples. Just like scarring. Um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to hop in the shower, come back out, and finish off this. Um, because after that we're gonna be doing the whole NXN line, and I'm gonna explain to you guys about that. By the way, this is not sponsored, so I'm just showing you guys this just because I want you guys to know. So I'll catch you guys in a bit. All right, so I know I look the same. <laughs> I just, I don't have my actual PJ shirt on just because, I don't know, I just, I don't want to wear the shirt, so I put this back on just for the video. But anyways, so I'm at the shower now, let's have my hair back up, I'm going to put my scarf on so that when my wig lays down nicely, anywho. So what I first do, you ask guys see me use the first aid beauty face cleanser, right? So now I'm going to use the NXN. Acne Edit Cleanser. Now, for NXN Beauty, they have different regimens, skin regimens for different skin types, whether it's acne prone, oily, dry, combination. Um, I'm combination, but I'm also, like, I also have acne. So I was like, let me just get acne, um, what's it called? Let me just get like the acne products. So this one is called, or their line is Acne Edit Cleanser. Well, this is the Acne Edit period. And I'm just trying to dry off the bottles because I was just showered and it's super steamy in here. And like all the bottles are wet. So anywho, so the first step is the cleanser. Um, says with probiotics, organic green tea, and salic salic salicylic acid. I think I said that right. Looks like this. See, eliminates the dirt, rewind the makeup, rebalance the skin, witness the power of our exclusive probiotic fuel. Smart bacteria complex at work merged with organic green tea and dermatologist trusted. So salicylic, salicylic, I can't say it, acid, our rich 
oil-free, sulfate-free cleanser helps remove buildup from pores and reduce blemish formation. So this, honestly, along the way has been helping my blemishes. It's still a little red, but before it used to be a lot worse. Trust and believe that. So, same steps like I did before. I'm going to wet the little brush that I used to wash my face, put this on top, and scrub. I use a little bit just because the bottle is small, which sucks. By the way, this is like a monthly thing, and it's like a monthly subscription, so you can cancel it whenever you want to. But I literally use like that much. And my mirror is foggy, so I can't see myself, which is great. Let me actually wipe that down. Just so I can see myself. And I like to focus it like on my cheeks. And this doesn't really like foam that much. But I just do this in circular motions on my cheeks. It foams actually just a little bit. Not like the first aid, but I like to do it here. My pores are really large right here. I need a facial. And just do it like this, do it like this. Scrub, scrub, scrub. <laughs> yeah. And then the forehead, I try not to get wet just because I have my wig on, but I'm just gonna do that. Around the eyes. So just keep away from my eyes, but I like to go around the eyes because I still have makeup and stuff there. So. And for me, it doesn't say to let it sit, but I like to let it sit on my face. I like to let it sit on my face to let it like settle in my skin because I feel like if I just put it on and then I just wash it off right away, it's not really, I'm not really giving it a chance to work. Does that make any sense? Or, um, or to do its job. So I like to let it sit a while, let it sit. I'm just going to listen to some music, um, check my Instagram. Mac, which means chill. <laughs> um, but yeah, I'm just taking my notifications. So again, I'm just patting my face. Alright, so the next step that I like to do is step two, which is the acne edit toner with probiotics, wild roseberry, and salicylic. You know that word I can't say. Acid. Looks like this. I would normally use a cotton ball or a cotton pad for this, but I don't have any right now, so I'll have to use tissue. And this is how the top looks like, and you literally just press down. I like to get up a lot. And literally, I just put it on, I kind of squeeze it onto my skin, because the tissue kind of soaks it up a lot. Um, and I just like put it in the areas that I have a lot of acne, basically everywhere. Not that I have acne everywhere, but I just put it everywhere, just because. And it smells really, really good, believe it or not. And it just smells like, like flowers. It kind of smells like perfume, but it doesn't have, like, I don't know how to explain it. It just smells like f fresh, like, plants and, like, rose, basically. Okay. Next is step three. Step three is the acne edit spot treatment um, with probiotics, ginger, licorice, and sulfur. So this, it says, um, it says powerful sulfur targets acne on contact. 
as well as helps inhibit future breakouts. Probiotics help balance skin, while ginger and licorice help to soothe irritated skin. Directions apply a very small amount directly to breakouts or breakout prone areas one to three times daily. Avoid contact with eyes. I only do it once a day. I should do it more than once a day. I have to face this way because I can't really see in the camera. But I just put it on the spots that I have the breakouts at. So I just dyed it everywhere that I have like scarring. And and I literally tap it into my skin like this. I don't really rub it in that much. I just kind of pat it into my skin. And it says that you're not supposed to rinse it off. And you just leave it on your face overnight. Which I like. And it's like those like white creams where like, like it'll just rub off, rub off, rub off when you sleep this like just settles in your skin like a regular cream so i like this a lot and it feels nice too it burns a little bit but not burning like it bothers like burning like it's working um what else oh let me show you how this looks like so that's how the last step is acne at an overnight treatment with probiotics natural retinols Multi-fruit acids, lactic acid, and then the other word that I can't say. Um, so let's see, it says natural retinols from blue, green, algae, and organic green tea help reduce the appearance of acne scarring and leave skin touchable, soft, clear, and healthy looking. I'm not gonna lie, for some reason when I wash my face, it's like the redness shows more. But when I put this on my face and I wake up in the morning, the redness went from red to like a very, very like pink. So I don't know. But this is how this looks like. And this is like a pump. So I literally just one pump on the areas that have acne. And I do the same thing and just this one I kind of spread out a little bit. But I pat it into the skin. Just a little bit of rubbing and patting. This is just what's been working for me so far. I've been using this for almost a month now. And it's been helping. My skin used to look worse. I just gotta keep using it. Um, I do have like te textured skin too, like right here. I just, I need to get rid of all of that. Like all the dead skin. Um... And that's basically it. So that is my skincare routine as of right now. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, hope it was helpful if you're someone who's like acne prone and you want to try out something. I'm using NXN Beauty right now. Also, First Aid Beauty from Sephora. That's pretty good too. Um, but yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give this video a like if you like it. Also, turn on your post notifications so you'll be alert whenever I do post a new video. It will be the bell button by the subscribe button on my channel. Also, follow me on my Snapchat and my Instagram. I'll leave them up here as always. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.